Hey everybody, it's Roger with Roger's Reviews, and just lost my knife. Anyways, how's everybody doing today? It's been a rainy day today, a little bit rainy. Um, had a few packages come in the mail. We're going into our slow season, um, but uh, our salesman is out of commission. He's having neck surgery, so I had to do a few estimates today wasn't able to get to a few of them because I was working so it's looking bad about doing all the all the estimates yourself sometimes you can't get to them all even if you're slow because you gotta work but anyway we'll get through it I'll make it work out and uh, hopefully it's uh, we'll be able to catch a few more estimates next week um, just work in a few days so save this packaging. It's kind of lightweight. I think there's some metal in there. Probably. It was six dollars and forty nine cents. Can you guess what it is? <clears throat> What can you buy for six dollars and forty-nine cents? If you were a tree guy, what would you purchase? What would you get for six dollars and forty-nine cents? Well, if you go to the store, like the steel, these are a lot more expensive. <laughs> um, and also, too, these are pretty expensive if you go to the steel shop. Sometimes I'll give them to you, but a lot of times I don't even go to the steel shop because uh, it's, it's like 20 minutes there and 20 minutes back, and plus it's an hour there just to get some nuts and bolts. So we lost a few of these the other day, so I figured I'd have some spares on the truck. I bought some before, but I don't know where they're at. So we'll put this in a place where I can find it on the truck. So that way, the next time we lose one, um, and we also have an oil cap. I'm getting rid of all my T50s. They just don't run right. I was talking to another guy yesterday, and he's like, same thing. You know, the saws, I buy them brand new. They run fine when I first start them, and then I can't get them started. Sometimes there's a special process to get them started the first time. I don't have time for that. No tree guys have time for that. So if anybody else has problems with their MS-250s not cranking or unable to crank them after you get them cranked initially, let me know in the comment section. I'm selling all my T50s. I think I got three or four left. Sell them cheap. So if anybody wants one, let me know. Um, I'm going to skip over the medium size or whatever you want to call it, smaller saws. I'm just going to have <clears throat> my top handle with the Pico bar and chain, 16 inch. I'm gonna have my pole saws with the Pico bar, 16 inch, and I'm gonna to totally skip over the mid-size saws. So I'm not gonna have anything like a T50 on the truck. I'm either gonna have little baby saws with 16 inch bars with Pico chains, or I'm gonna have the big boys. I'm not even gonna mess with those middle ones anymore. That'll eliminate all my middle saws, all the middle saws. I'll either have big files or small saws, no medium size files, no medium size chains. So it's going to make life a lot simpler and, uh, you know, because you can only keep so many saws on the truck and normally when you have a 16 inch uh, bar, by the time you're done using that saw, it runs out of gas, you're ready for a big saw anyway. That medium saw is kind of like, I mean, you make two or three cuts, you need a big saw anyway. So just go ahead and eliminate that middle section, make your life a lot easier. And sometimes we don't even use big saws for the small jobs like 16 inch you can just run it run your little saws a little bit harder and finish the job so anyway this is Roger from Rogers reviews if you guys need a scrunch or saw wrench and some nuts and you don't want to go to the uh, saw shop I mean why would you spend a couple hours out of your day to get this when you can order it online for six bucks and be at your house in the next day so anyway if you like this uh, <coughs> video, 
please crush the like button and there's many more of these to come help you give you more information and help you make a better buying decision and if you're a small tree service or you run the show pretty much by yourself you'll have the time to go to the uh, saw shop every every time you need another bowl so anyway see you next time have a great day